Something very interesting is happening today. Welcome back to the Crypto Report, guys. I'm Crypto Kip, and I want to give you guys another update on Ka, the meme token Crow with Knife that has taken the Kronos chain by storm. Now, guys, I put originally $200 into this, turned it into $1,000, and then I doubled down with a big bag, and we told you about it here on this channel. Buy 100,000 crow worth of crow with knife that's worth now about 200,000 crow. And I took 25% of my initial off the table. That was my update yesterday for you guys. And what am I doing today? Holding strong. Uh, there was a huge dip on this token this morning. It came all the way from a couple zeros, one eight last night, down to a couple zeros. Uh, one one or something like that. A huge, almost 50% crash, probably even bigger. But it's getting bought up right now. And the crazy thing about that, guys, is that Bitcoin, Solana, and Ethereum are going down. Now, what I thought would be going, and Crow, and Crow is going down as well. Now, we said yesterday in our video that Crow could get a dip to 12 cents. That's exactly what happened. In fact, it went to like 11 cents and change. I wish I could get back to my computer to share with you guys some charts and share with you guys some of these DEXs and the actual bags that I have. Uh, but I'm still holding on to 1.5 trillion uh, of these CAW tokens. I bought 400 and something thousand, I think, of this cat with main token, which that, I don't know, guys, like these could all be rugs. You just got to be careful. You got to do your own research. Uh, and then I still have my 400,000 crow coins. So guys, I am very much in this Kronos ecosystem. I'm very much holding my crow coins strong. My goal here with these meme coin moves is risky, is risky. And it's not for most people, guys. You got to be aware of that. Uh, fortunately, it's playing out well right now as the broader market's going down. My meme bags are going up within Kronos, and that's pretty decent to accumulate more Kronos tokens, which is the end goal here for me. Of course, participating in these meme tokens and making money on those is great, but what are you going to do? Are you going to take profits? Are you going to take your profits into cash? Are you going to take profits into Kronos coins? My strategy is to take profits into Kronos coins the same way I'm playing with the meme tokens on stacks, which are also very risky, and I intend on taking profits out of those meme tokens into the stacks tokens. This is where I'm at. My goal here with this channel is not to, you know, not to come out here and brag about my bags, but to just be transparent. Transparency is key. I want to keep you guys posted with all of our plays. I see some people that were very upset that I sold 100,000 crow. I get it, I get it, I get it. But again, my goal is to accumulate more crow. And I'm taking my own chances with my own bags and keeping you guys aware of exactly what those plays are. Now, by no means, guys, should you be just following my plays, okay? Everybody should have their own plays and you should be doing your own research. What we do here is not financial advice. That's just not what it is. What it is is entertainment, it is education for newcomers to the space to learn how some strategies are made within this space. You could look to Black Sea to see how he's been profiting within the Solani ecosystem, his plays with Bonk. He might be buying a big bag of Bonk here on the dip, and I, I understand that strategy. I'm not personally playing with the Bonk bag. Uh, I'm playing around with the Kronos meme tokens and the Crow fam here. And uh, Black Sea's got a heck of a lot of Crow coins as well, and we are just continuing to look forward here as there is more bull market ahead. Taking profit on the way up is something that I recommend to anybody, you know, and don't invest anything that you're not willing to lose. And I'm not just talking about in the memes, guys. I'm talking about in Crow, I'm talking about in Solana in general, stacks, you know, crypto is volatile, it is risky. Bitcoin just hit its previous all time high, and today, it is getting a retracement down to, I think, $62,000 at the time of this recording. To think about that, guys, we were at $74,000 just a little bit ago. I have over a 15% crash here for Bitcoin. In fact, I should look and see exactly what the crash is. Some altcoins are holding up. Some altcoins are crashing down. What's crazy to me right now is that as Kronos coin is crashing, this meme token, Crow with Knife, though it had a dip this morning, is actually hanging on pretty darn strong. It's actually been very, very strange. And so it's great. I love to see it. Just as people on the Solani ecosystem wanted to celebrate Bonk and its success, I can feel it. The Crow fam wants to celebrate Crow with Knife and its success. Now, some people out there hate meme tokens. I'll let you in on a little secret. It's not that big of a secret. I've told you guys about it many times on this channel. I personally I don't like meme coins inherently. They're fun, but at the end of the day, they are gambling, guys. 
They're extremely risky plays. And if you're new to this space, honestly, I probably wouldn't, I would probably be avoiding them if I was a newcomer to this space. And if I was dabbling with them, again, I would be using pennies on the dollar. Another big mistake that I see people doing with these meme tokens is they end up buying fake versions of these meme tokens. For example, Crow with Knife, you gotta be careful. If you guys are buying this thing and, and you just do your own research, guys, okay? Do your own research. You saw the dip, this thing crashed 50% overnight. It is retracing back upward right now. Hopefully that momentum continues. We'll see how it plays out. I'm holding strong. Uh, but what I've seen people are doing is they're buying fake versions of Crow with Knife, actually. There's a fake contract address out there. So do your research, go to the official Twitter page for it. Just go, if you're not on Twitter, you should be, because that's gonna be one of the ways to get the fastest information and some of the best information to kind of confirm your plays and making sure that what is real is real. You gotta look through, you gotta do your own digging on that, guys. Um, if I was at my desk right now, I'd be showing you guys my screen and how I found the contract address, but I, I just can't do it, I'm remote still. Anyway, uh, update for you guys. My goal with these memes is to get my 500,000 crow back, maybe even earn an extra 500,000 crow, which would be spectacular, to get a million crow bag, that would be spectacular. But let's see how it plays out. There are huge risks with these things, guys. These could be rugs, okay, guys? These could be rugs. I have no affiliation, no collaboration with anybody from Crypto.com, anybody from the Kronos chain, anybody from any of these meme token teams. We're just not doing that on this channel. The only affiliations that I have is to the Crow fam. We're on Twitter, we're communicating with other people in the space, just having fun, and that's exactly what it is, guys. And along the way, gains are coming to Crow With Knife, and it's a lot of fun, guys. Let me know what your honest thoughts are on this in the comments down below. Let me know what your honest thoughts are on the fact that I sold 100,000 Crow to do this strategy in the effort to earn more Crow. I know some people aren't a fan of it. I know some people are. I'm very curious to see more responses in the comments. We've been getting a lot more engagement lately. People are getting heated up. Some people hate memes, some people love them. Show us your opinion in the comments down below. That's all I got in this one, guys. I am Crypto Kip. Uh, in the meantime, if you're looking for what comes next, just be on the lookout. If Bitcoin keeps crashing, so is Crow. We could break back down below 10 cents, but frankly, if, if I'm making a, a guess here, I, I'm not looking at my charts very closely right now. My heart of hearts tells me it's all still bullish, okay? There is a Bitcoin halving coming up. These, these ETFs are still scooping up Bitcoin and there is not selling pressure from the ETFs. This is retail selling, taking profits, shuffling profits, dare I say panic selling. Some people are profit taking, which is great. And then, hey, if you profit take on this way up and then we get a dip and you can buy back in, you can multiply your bags. I'm more of a time in versus timing the market kind of guy. Time in the markets beats timing the market. There's a strategy where you can take some profits and anybody who's got cash on the sidelines right now, you have a very tasty dip. So if there's any tokens that you've been wanting to get and you've been buying it on green candles, and today you see some red candles, I would urge you to just think about your strategy here. The goal for any crypto investor should be to buy low and sell high. Again, you want to buy low and sell high. Please do your own research, folks. I do love my audience. I love the Crow fam. I love doing YouTube content. Uh, I, I feel the tension, I feel the fear out there right now as Bitcoin is dipping, but I'm staying strong, guys. I have a, another trip coming up to Utah. I think I'm going to get to record a video for my studio tomorrow morning, uh, but then I will be home on Sunday, so just in about a week, and I can't wait to get back to the studio and back into my own bed and uh, just more active with you guys again. The vacation's been fun. My wife had a great time. This was our baby moon. We have a, a little baby on the way. I'm very excited. and. I'm trying to earn my keep for my kiddo for the future, as I know you guys are trying to do. You guys are trying to find a way to earn generational wealth with cryptocurrency, financial independence and freedom. I want each and every single one of you to find it, but it is not easy, friends. Not everybody wins in crypto. You have to be careful. You have to do your own research and be careful because there are scammers in the chats, on Twitter, on this channel, unfortunately. We try to block it all out, but we'll do what we can, okay, guys? That's all I got in this one on crypto. Kip, this is the Crypto Report. Don't forget to smash the like button, guys. Subscribe to the channel for more content. And as always, folks, don't forget to DCA, HODL, and of course, we will see you in the next one. If you guys want to become a member on this channel, you can do so in the link in the description down below. Uh, you get access to our private Discord, and you also get uh, a custom emojis during our live streams, which we'll be resuming next week. 
every week, Monday through Friday, except for when I'm out of town, guys. That's all. I'll see you next time, folks. Two videos here if you want to check them out. Peace, y'all.